Feeding the world's hungry is their mission, and North Okanagan Valley Gleaners had a record year. For the first time, we've gone over a million pounds of produce, and that would be uh, a little bit of fruit, but mostly vegetables. The whole year, we've been receiving lots of produce, and uh, there hasn't really been a let up at all through the year. The plant is based in Lavington, and it's here where they make a dehydrated soup mix using donated produce from farmers. Most of the food we get uh, comes from the large uh, growers and producers. Some of it is local. Uh, over half of it currently would be coming from outside of the North Okanagan area but it's all surplus. Each bag of soup provides 100 meals and volunteers work together to create the mixture. We'll have people who are cutting the vegetables. Uh, we dice it into small pieces, put it into the racks, dry it, and put it into all these containers around here. And at the end of the year, we calculate how much of each product we have to know a comprehensive soup that we can put together. Since opening in 2007, the organization has been growing. And along with the growth, they've been shipping more and more food around the world. 2011, we hit a million point two, so that was a huge milestone for us. The last two years, we've been at five million meals. Last year we did 750,000 pounds total vegetables donated. And with the million pounds they received in 2015, they will be able to provide at least 7 million meals for those who need it. And still, the charity wants to keep growing, believing there is potential to do even more. There are other growers, other sources of, uh, of produce out there that's currently going to waste. So we know if we can bring that into the building here, if we can get enough volunteers, and if we can upgrade our equipment, we should be able to double our production uh, within a few years. The organization depends heavily on donations, but in order to continue growing, the key ingredient is finding more volunteers. Without the volunteers, uh, all the equipment and all the, uh, the donations of, uh, of supplies really wouldn't mean anything. We need volunteers to actually turn it into the final product, which is a, a soup mix to feed the hungry. Now, one thing you might not know about Gleaners is that they also have a used furniture store to help offset some of the operating costs at the plant. The store is located at 4405 29th Street in Vernon, and they're always looking for donations of furniture and appliances in good, usable condition. For Go on Shaw TV, I'm Jamie Ross.